Canadian medical cannabis is often mislabeled, according to a new study by researchers at the University of British Columbia. Dr. Jonathan Page, the study's lead, says plants labeled as sativa or indica are frequently not as advertised. He said those classifications are actually quite inaccurate. The plants that were reported to be sativa were often not genetically sativa, and vice versa with indica as well. To complete the study, researchers examined the DNA of 81 cannabis samples and 43 hemp samples. The scientists only found a small association between the strain's reported history and the ancestry inferred from their DNA. For example, one strain, Jamaican lamb's bread, classified as sativa by the grower, was almost identical to an Afghani indica strain. Furthermore, the reported percentage of sativa or indica in a strain is frequently incorrect, according to the study. Predictably, the researchers also found a high amount of genetic separation between cannabis and hemp. However, they found that cannabis indica is more similar to hemp than sativa strains. According to Page, the study doesn't disprove popular belief that sativa and indica strains provide different effects. Instead, he says the research shows there's currently no reliable way of letting patients know what they're actually consuming. Page said, we have this sort of confused system and I think it's the result of a lack of research and prohibition. There hasn't been a lot of science done on the plant. It lags behind other crops. Page suggests that the industry would benefit from wider use of genetic testing, which would help patients make more informed decisions about their cannabis consumption. 